Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to convert 7 eighths to a decimal. Now when we convert a fraction to a decimal, we can do this by dividing the numerator, the top number of the fraction, by the denominator, the bottom number of the fraction. So for 7 eighths, we can set this up as 7 divided by 8. Then we go through the division process. So how many whole groups of 8 in 7? How many 8s in 7? Well, we can't do that. So we need a decimal and a zero in order to work through this. Once we have the decimal and the zero, bring the decimal straight up into where the quotient, the answer will be. And now we can think of this as 70 divided by eight. So how many whole groups of eight in 70? How many eights in 70? Well, eight, that gets us to 64. So we put eight up here above the zero. And to make sure it goes above the zero, since we used that zero and thought of this as 70. And this will line us up correctly. And I'm actually going to extend the division bar here as well. Now we multiply. 8 times 8, 64. Subtract, 70 minus 64 is 6. So we don't have that clean cut zero there at the bottom, so we can continue on by using another zero that we can bring down. And now we have 60. 60 divided by 8. That's going to be 7. That gets us to 56. So we put 7 up top there. Now we multiply. 7 times 8, 56. Subtract. 60 minus 56 is 4. So we don't have that clean cut zero there at the bottom yet. So let's use another zero that we can bring down in order to continue on. And now we have 40 divided by 8, which is 5. So we put 5 up top here, multiply, 5 times 8 is 40, subtract, 40 minus 40 is 0. So we have that clean cut 0 there at the bottom and nothing else to bring down within our problem, so we are done. 7 eighths equals 875 thousandths. So let's write this over here. 7 eighths equals 0 0.875. 875 thousandths. So there you have it. There's how to convert 7 eighths to a decimal. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.